Hey everybody, it's Friday, so I'm doing another Old New York Times crossword. Uh, I started this last Friday, and it went kind of how I expected. Um, a lot of words I did not recognize, like short crosswordies types words. A lot of French, um, and not the immediately obvious well-known French, but like, like droll in French, which has an E on the end instead of L. Um, so I'm going to do another one of these. I'm sticking with the idea of, like, it's August 18th, 2023, so I'm going to do August 18th, 1955. Um, the year is kind of arbitrary. This one <clears throat> is a Thursday. Um, the last one I did didn't seem to have a theme. And again, I don't think the crosswords get more difficult over time, or like over the course of the week, this far back. And I don't think Thursday, like nowadays, that would be kind of the tricky one. But since there's not really a theme, I don't think... Um, I don't expect this to be a tricky sort of thing. I mean, it's, it's going to be difficult because <laughs> there are going to be words that I just don't know. But um, let's give this a try. Um, so this is by Jack Luzado, um, editor Margaret Farrar. Again, she was the first New York Times crossword editor, longtime New York Times crossword editor, set a lot of the standards we still follow today in mainstream puzzles. Okay, so... Reminiscent meal. Cowpokes mount. Um, is it like a pony? Spanish jug. Oya? I, th I think that is a <laughs> type of word. Brother in arms. Um, <laughs> most addicted to jive. I'm afraid to see what this one is. Um... Okay, do-it-yourself production. I don't know if either of these words is, is correct, so... Um, okay, eat... Cotton processors, probably gins. So it's probably going to be an EST at the end here, whatever this ends up being. Flavorful part. Um... Okay, bitter cries, probably something ending in S. So lining fabric, sateen. Uh, defense, olive genus. Um, I think this is oleo. I think like oleo margarine. I think that's olive. I could be wrong here. The fellows who may win. Newspaper service. Ah, uh, boy. Eat. Dine? Could be that. Owner of a bad tongue. Somebody like who swears? Balls of tread or yarn. What do you call a ball of yarn other than a ball of yarn? Fellow. Bulgarian coins. Uh, hooded garments for illusion wear. Um, is that like a parka? Is fellow a chap? Man of daring, maybe a hero? Turned aside, be averted. Uh, I'm never gonna get this by itself. It's gonna have to be crosses. Do it yourself. Handiwork fits. Reminiscent meal. Ash, posh, pesh. A oh, slanderer, owner of a bad tongue. Balls of tread or yarn, Bulgarian coins. So do you think? Shoes? Clues? Can anything else go in there? 
<laughs> I will guess clues. No, yeah. I've never heard that as a word. So, and Leva, no. But, um, give it a shot. Okay, pony I think is wrong. I think most addicted to jive is slangiest. Maybe hoss? Reminiscent meal a hash? Allies, brother in arms. Okay, Cinda, Kit, Olia, or is this just wrong? <laughs> um, flavorful part. Spice? Defense, plea? Bitter cries, sobs. Ah, I think I got the Northwest done. All right, fellas who may win. Um, best, best men? I mean, fellows, I don't know. Table companion, meal, mate? Is that, uh, that might be right. Alarm is the buzzer of a clock. No, it couldn't be this, right? Clothes moth, not sure. Author of America the Beautiful. Don't know. Significant happening, maybe an event? Rough grass? Vital. I feel like I should get this. Alive? Have like having vitals? Made with split rattan. Okay, I think this is sedge. C E D makes sense here. Whale stripped carcass. <laughs> is there a technical term for a whale stripped carcass? Maybe this is caned? Retrogression. Let's be back something. Uh, <laughs> uh, ring? Let's come back to this. Maybe I can get more of this nine down. Dogma. Tenant? Maybe? Passover feast? Oh. Okay, so it's not a messmate? As in, like, if you are in the army or something and Passover feast is a satyr? Okay. Back step for retrogression? Small child? What is a tot? Embargo. Ban? Is Tad a small child? <laughs> Much harried. The set? Maybe? Maybe it is. Okay. Ornamented with fringed knobs. Ta uh, I was going to say tasseled, but that does, that's too short. Car model. Okay, what do I have? Well filled. Fled, maybe ran. Make imperfect, mar. Jungle knife, machete. Maybe a sedan is a type of car model. Home loving. So this is probably a s domestic. This is maybe t not tasseled, but something like that. Maybe it's tasseled. Do I know how to spell tassel? <laughs> Cause to pause. Color, color similar to chartreuse. Is ochre similar to chartreuse? Ochre? I don't know what color ochre is, now that I'm thinking about it. Where Innsbruck is. Where is Innsbruck? Okay, Aesop's point is a moral. After song. This isn't looking like a word. I'm gonna 
Ochre's probably not right. Olive? What color is chartreuse? I don't know what that is either. Is that a green? Baffled Pursuit, Evade. Guided again, Reled. Okay. Cause to pause. Runaway, Elope. Is that right? After song. E Hode? Either deter or tyro? Defer? No, tyro. I don't know, know if that's a word, but it sounds like more of a word than viral. Okay. Gloomy. Trick with a disappearing P. Is that like a, the cup kind of magic trick? I don't know what that's called. On one's toes. Blank go. Revise, maybe edit. Let's go. Dismal, yeah. Add it on one's toes. Or a tip. Could that be right? And this is like flips. Oh, this is, yeah, shell game. Thought it over. Meditated. Word of Innocence, a World of Innocence, Eden, okay. A Remnant of Erosion, Blank Dive, let's try Nose Dive. Oh, Mesa might be a Remnant of Erosion. Member of the Family for short. Gran, Reanimator. It's like bringing somebody back from the dead. All right, fraudulent. Could be fake, and this is season to say salt. Eat it. How about scram? Virginia Willow. Not sure. Wrinkle. Plural suffix in zoology. Okay, engine room crew slang. Okay, rubble, maybe that's debris? Black gang? They get black from, like, coal? Well-filled, replete. Recreator. Plural suffix in zoology. A C E A. That feels like it could be right. Okay. Author of America the Beautiful. What's a name that fits there? Bates. Baines, Bales. Bates sounds most like a name. Whale stripped carcass. <laughs> Krang. <laughs> okay, I that was all correct. Every guess I made there was correct. That is astonishing. Okay. Um, Okay, Kreng is a whale strip carcass. So some of these they should bring back um, to crosswords. Tania, clothes moss. Okay. A-C-E-A. -E I'm trying to think of a word that, that I've, I've heard with that, but it seemed right. Virginia Willow, Willow. Like Latin names for stuff you just don't see as often anymore. There's also Olea. Like that... You might see it on like a Saturday, um, all the genus, but not on a Thursday. Um, clues. Maybe that's a word people still use today. Um, but Leva, 
Bulgarian coins. Bulgaria on the euro now, anyway? I don't know. Um, what else is here? Where Innsbruck is. Is this like a state in... Actually, I don't even know what country Innsbruck is in. Um, what else was rough here? Epode? Epode? After song? I cannot believe I got that right without any checks or hints. That's amazing. Okay. Well, um, yeah, that was another old New York Times crossword. Again, I'll be doing these every Friday. So uh, if you enjoyed this, check back next week. I also mostly do great recent crosswords with a focus mostly on indie crosswords. I've been working through um, Will Nettiger's best of each month collections. Um, but there's some New York Times and Wall Street Journal, whatever, mixed in there. All right. Um, or if you enjoy the subscribe. Otherwise, thank you for watching.